in this lecture you are going to learn about the star operator that is used with pointers star operator is also called value at address operator or d reference operator and sometimes it is also referred to as indirection operator basically the use of star operator in pointers is to extract the value stored at a particular address in this example suppose i have got a variable called a and star ap is pointed to int similarly i have got another variable called b which has been assigned some value say 90000 or something and then i have got this variable star dp which happens to be pointed to float now what i am going to do is i am going to put address of this variable a into pointer to int ip and i am going to store address of this variable b into pointer to float dp right so far so good but after that what i want to do is i want to print the addresses of sorry not addresses i want to print the values of these variables a and b not using the convention method like printing a and b i just want to use pointers so what i can do is in order to print the value of a what i can do is i can write star ip like i know ip is containing address of a so star will make it like the sole expression value stored at address this address so which will be nothing else but the value of the variable a similarly star dp as we know dp is containing address of the variable b so star dp means value stored at this address which is in dp so that will be nothing else but value of this variable b uh, i can explain it with the help of a diagram uh, suppose uh, this is our variable uh, b uh, let me make uh, the value of uh, this variable b same as has been shown in the diagram okay so this is the variable a which i have assumed to be stored at address location 101 this is the variable b which i have assumed to be stored at address location 113 right and when i had written in the program like uh, ip is equal to ampersand a so ip pointer variable is supposed to store address of the variable a which happens to be 101 similarly in the programming statement i have written dp is equal to ampersand b so what is the address of b 113 that will get stored into this pointer variable dp so in the program when i have written star ip as star is value at address operator what is in ip 101 so the expression will mean value stored at address 101 now what is the value stored at address 101 100 which is nothing else but the value of this variable a similarly in the program like i have written star dp so we will go to dp what is contained in dp dp is containing address of b as we had written dp is equal to ampersand b in the program so dp is containing address of b so star dp will mean value stored at address 113 what is the value stored at address 113 90.99 which is nothing else but the value of this variable b so this was the expression explanation of this program uh i will execute the program and you can see the results yourself see this is our output when i had written star ip so star ip is printing the value 100 as i have explained and star dp has printed the value of the variable b which is 90.99 so this is how we people can use star operator